A laparoscopic cholecystectomy is a keyhole operation to remove the gallbladder. It's, a, it's an operation that is done under general anesthetic and uh, four holes are made in the upper part of the abdomen through which laparoscopic instruments are inserted and the gallbladder is removed. Uh, if this operation is done in a planned fashion and we call this as an elective laparoscopic cholecystectomy, patients can be discharged on the same day or the morning after uh, surgery. Basically, they can be done as either day cases or, uh, or just on a 24-hour or a 36-hour stay in the hospital. Uh, but if the same operation is done in an emergency setting, they may have to stay in the hospital a little longer. Uh, it's a relatively safe operation uh, and it's widely performed. However, there are some risks, uh, just like how uh, uh, there are risks with any operation. This operation also comes with risks. There are some general risks like bleeding and infection and, and um, risks related to the anesthetic. But specific to this operation, there is a risk which uh, we call as injury to the bile duct. Uh, thankfully, with uh, increasing expertise and uh, advancement in technology, um, these risks are extremely low and most of the time patients simply sail through the operation. After a laparoscopic cholecystectomy, the recovery is uh, usually quite good. Patients are expected to get out of their beds and uh, start walking in about uh, four to six hours time. Um, there is no specific dietary restriction after this operation. They can basically start eating and drinking as normal from the next day onwards. The pain that they experience is, uh, is minimal and most of the time uh, this is well controlled with just a few tablets of paracetamol over the next few days. Um, the holes that we uh, perform, the holes that we make to perform this operation are all closed with absorbable uh, sutures and these sutures uh, dissolve away uh, very well in a, in a few weeks time and therefore there's no hassle of having to go to a doctor or a nurse for a suture removal or anything of that, of that kind. Um, the scar that uh, the patient eventually gets uh, is, uh, is hardly visible uh, after a few months. Uh, sometimes when patients come back to the doctor after several years and if the doctor happened to ask the patient you know, could you please point out exactly where those holes are? The patients um, find it hard even to locate, to precisely locate where exactly uh, they are. Such is the, um, uh, such is the level uh, of, uh, of healing that usually happens. The scars completely fade away and the patients have completely forgotten that they have actually had an operation.